Good morning once again, Weekenders. It is Saturday morning. Me and Landon are out here uh, in the van. We're kind of near Truckee, California, near Lake Tahoe. And we're going to go on a little bit of mountain bike ride. Go up to the top of this mountain up here, I think. I don't really know. Um, I don't think Landon's too excited about the mountain bike ride, but we're going to make him do it anyways. Let's take it slow. Where you go, I go to. And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you. Let's take it slow. Who cares where we gotta be? You know you'll have a good time wherever you're with me. Let's take it All right, guys, made it to the top of the mountain. Landon is still way down there. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to wait for him to make it to the top or just ride down and let him turn around wherever he is. But you guys need to go leave a comment or send Landon a text or a call or something. Let him know he needs to start putting in the effort because uh, every time the going gets tough, he starts walking, and that just ain't right. We both know how to swim, no worries, let's go for now. Let's take it slow, where you go, I go to. And if you hit the bottom, I'm going down with you. Let's take it slow, who cares where we gotta be? You know you'll have a good time wherever you're with me. Let's take it Just finished with the mountain bike trail ride. Uh, we cut the ride a little short because Landon hates riding mountain bikes for some reason. He didn't end up making it to the top though and then rather than doing like the whole trail which involves some more climbing and a big loop we just came pretty much straight back on the trail we went up. We took a few little detours. Ended up being about seven miles with 900 feet of climbing. So not super long, not super difficult. But we are going to do another bike ride pretty much right now. And uh, we're going over to the Truckee Bike Park. So see you there. All right, we uh, made it to Truckee Bike Park. Got my dirt jump bike, Landon's bike. Also got some fresh new uh, like tan tires on my bike because the slicks don't really hold up too well on the dirt. But uh, we were ready to shreddy. If we try to believe in anything greater than a miracle, it wouldn't be this difficult. If we, we try to be a negative bull, yeah, we could be taking control. Yeah. If we try to believe in anything greater than a miracle, it wouldn't be this difficult. If we, we try to be a negative bull, yeah, we could be taking control. Yeah.
something greater than a miracle It wouldn't be this difficult If we, we try to be a negative bull yeah. We could be taking control yeah. If we, try to believe in anything greater than a miracle It wouldn't be this difficult If we, we try to be a negative bull yeah. We could be taking control yeah. All right, weekenders, we're done at the uh, bike park now. Gotta say, uh, Truckee Bike Park is definitely my favorite bike park around here that I've been to. Uh, out of all the ones that I've been to, really, numero uno for the Truckee Bike Park. They actually had some really sick jumps that we didn't even notice until we were driving away. Uh, so probably gonna have to come back and hit those another time. But uh, right now, we got our frizz in our hands, and we're gonna go play some disc golf at a new course. by uh, the way that we're in the van you can probably tell we are done disking I ended up throwing even par uh, I had a couple boats a couple birds they ended up evening out I actually just saved par on the last hole that I birded and landed ended up 11 over par which is honestly not too bad because that was a very difficult course there's a lot of trees and if you don't throw it pretty much perfect then uh, you're going into the trees and your hole's over. Okay, weekenders. Uh, one of the other reasons why we were in Lake Tahoe is to go do some snorkeling. Landon has somehow convinced me to not use a wetsuit. Said like 60 degrees in the water. So, not gonna be terrible, especially if we keep moving. We are parked a good ways away from the water though, so we got a little bit of walking. Uh, not looking forward to that because no shoes, uh, all that other stuff. Um, let's go do some storking.
All right, guys, we're done snorkeling. Um, there's a big rainstorm right there. Lots of thunder and lightning. So we called it quits a little early. Uh, also, with no sun, it's freezing cold out. Um, we didn't bring any shirts or anything. So now we're gonna be cold all the way back to the van. Um, Mr. Landon, yeah. it looked like you were struggling a little bit for your first time snorkeling. Can you tell us a little bit about that? Well, my snorkeling experience is next to none, so I was still kind of learning how to do it. Um, I, would, I will say Sullivan was being a whiny baby about the cold water. I thought it was the warmest water I've ever been in, and I've never been cold in my life, so I'm not sure what he was talking about. But yeah, it was pretty dope. Uh, do it again. <laughs> okay, last stop of the day, steak and shake. We made a stop over at uh, Nick Alden Reed's house, picked up some new doors and a new elevator for the Kit Fox. Uh, that's about it. Uh, that's it for today. Unless Landon's got anything else to say. Croissant for the day. Good morning again, weekenders. Sunday morning now. Came down the road a little ways from Reno. We are now in uh, South Lake Tahoe over here at the Bijou Bike Park right behind me. Gonna do a little bit more dirt jumping and uh, that's pretty much the plan for right now. Uh, first thing though, I gotta change out of these sandals because it's not gonna work too good for jumping. So we're done hitting up the jumps at Bijou Bike Park now, and we've actually come down the road about an hour or so. We're a little west of Placerville. We're taking a little break from the drive to come hit up another disc golf course, and this one is at a middle school. They said it's like a really small youth course or something. Um, I see the first basket right now, actually. Uh, pretty excited to play. Okay, hole one. 138 feet. Pretty short. Nice. All right, uh, not much filming going on. Right after we finished hole two, two people came up to us and asked if we wanted to play doubles. We said, sure, why not? Never have played it before. So we did. Man Landon ended up losing by just one stroke. I tried to save it with an ace on the last hole. Made the ace, but it wasn't enough uh, to bring home the W. Overall though, uh, pretty interesting course, very short. Pretty much used a putter for every single throw. And uh, 10 out of 10. So we have made it back home now. Uh, that's me and Landon, in case you haven't been following along. And you might have noticed that Landon hasn't given any reviews on the activities this weekend. And that's because I'm trying a little something new. Got some little pieces of paper here, has all of our activities written on it. I'm gonna get him to rank them uh, from what he liked the most to what he liked the least. 
So we got them pretty much all in order. First up is van flat tire. You guys weren't there for, but it happened Friday night at like 10.30 or so at night. Uh, not too much fun, honestly. Then we got mountain bike trail ride, then the trucky dirt jumps, trucky disc golf, snorkeling in big blue, van camping, which uh, covers both nights, the Bijou dirt jumps, the doubles disc golf game, and the drive home. So Landon, please rank the activities. All right. First up, the most fun thing that Landon did was change the flat on the van. I could probably see that, he didn't do much. Next up, trucky dirt jumps. Then the snorkeling in big blue. Then the Bijou dirt jumps. Then the trucky disc golf. Then the mountain bike trail ride. Then the doubles disc golf. Then sleeping in the van. And then driving home. Anything else you have to add to this? Um, the van flat tire was a joke. I hope the viewers uh, thought that was a little bit funny. Um, my The most trouble I had was the mountain bike trail ride because I didn't love it. I didn't hate it. I enjoyed it. But it, from the ranking, it's... How about let's just fix this because this was just a joke. So let's do a new list. So now it's a more accurate list and... You can see I just moved van flat tire in between the van camping and the drive home. Um, and this is the correct order. Looks good. So uh, overall, not too many activities today. Mainly because uh, it was like a six hour drive back home. And uh, we just got on the interstate, kept going pretty much. And now we're here. 103 degrees outside so that's pretty much going to be it for today honestly the weekend wore me out a little bit but i gotta go get ready for work in the morning gotta go make the video that you're watching now and uh, that means it's gonna be it for the weekend hope you guys enjoyed watching the video and i uh, hope to see you next weekend croissant